So day three of the Australian Open is going on as we speak, and we have a huge, huge update on the Nadal injury that he suffered in his second round loss to Mackenzie McDonald. It looked like a hip injury at the time. This is what Rafa had to say in his press conference talking about how bad the injury was. So when asked in the press conference what part of the body did he hurt, Rafa said, the hip? I've had a couple of days like this, but nothing like today in that moment. So I don't know. I don't know what's going on. If it's muscle, if it's joint, I have a history in the hip. I've had to do treatments in the past, but it was not this amount of problem. I cannot move. Until I do the test, it's difficult to make a resolution. So there you have it. Rafa injured again. And I guess it comes down to now, how long is he going to be out for? Because he's supposed to be playing in Dubai in about a month's time at the end of February. Of course, he's the defending finalist from Indian Wells. And he hasn't played Miami over the last couple of years. But will he be out until the clay court season? That is the question. Last year, he got injured at Indian Wells. Didn't play until midway through the clay season. Still went on to win the French Open. But will Rafa be playing in the near future? Or do you think, let me know down in the comments below. Do you think that Rafa is going to be out until the clay court season? And we're not going to see him until April. But... Man, it's a tough Australian Open. We've seen a lot of injuries already. Rafa adds to that list. Djokovic obviously playing with some kind of injury as well. This is what happens when the goats get older. They're going to get injured. And this is the first time, I think in a very, very long time, that we don't know who's going to win this Australian Open now because injuries are a huge concern to the players that we expect to win these tournaments. But Rafa Nadal out of the Australian Open, injured again.